Kendall, this is your last chance to make a semi-graceful exit. Take it. Kendall, come on. Whatever you thought was going to happen isn't. You weren't here, Simone. Neither were you. Should I, should I tell them what happened, Brian? Should I tell your bride what just happened? You stood right here and you kissed me. You held me so tight I couldn't breathe. Now how can you marry her when you're in love with me? The way you looked at me, the way we danced together. I'm the one you love, Ryan. I'm the only one. I love the woman that came here to make things right. I kissed the woman that found it in her heart to forgive and to let go. I danced with the woman who let go of all the crap that was weighing us down. But the woman who took Greenlee prisoner and lied to me. Well, that woman I'm more than done with. I was over with her before I even got here. Love is enough for most people. Kendall, but not you. And definitely not us. Because the lies just keep coming. No, I, I, I'm not lying to you about this. I told you the truth about what counts. I love you. I'm not lying about that. That's not a lie. I'm marrying Greenland because I trust her. But you? There is no way that I can trust you now. I can't take your word for anything, Kendall. Not even the correct time. I mean, thank God I have a watch that I trust. Because when we meet in the Cambius boardroom, which will be the only place that we meet, I'll bring my trusty watch and a strong ally. Are you up for it? We're gonna go, partner. Partner? No. Yeah, my wedding present to Greenland is half of Cambius Industries. I am so going to enjoy owning you.